And now to our celebration of Juneteenth tonight at 5. June 19th, 1865 marked the end of slavery here in the U.S. with the enforcement of the Emancipation Park Proclamation in Texas. Our Rich and I today went to several events all around the city to ask people what this national holiday means to them. The Black Firefighters and Black Police Officer Associations organized the fourth annual Juneteenth Peace March, a parade from Mass Ave to Martin Luther King Jr. Park. Celebrate the significance of, of Juneteenth, but also plant a seed in these kids about the opportunity to serve their community. The mayor joined the Peace March and later made his Juneteenth remarks at the ribbon cutting ceremony for the new Recycle Force headquarters at Sherman Park. Juneteenth is America's genuine, true, and appropriate Independence Day. <laughs> Juneteenth is not just about recognizing the suffering of people, it's about acknowledging that we overcame. Yeah. Came out on the other side stronger, and we're holding on to that joy, because Juneteenth is about hope, and the promise of progress. Horizon House Day Shelter for People Experiencing Homelessness served over 350 meals at its second annual Juneteenth cookout. Knowing that 53% of the people who come to our day shelter are African American or black, we wanted to make sure that we're celebrating and recognizing that black Americans have not been free for very long in the, in the grand scheme of the American history. The Peace March ended a few blocks away at the Kennedy King Memorial. I met a couple who made it a point to visit the landmark for peace on Juneteenth, even in the heat of the day. Just to be out here, that right there alone, you know, that there alone, that's, that's powerful. I had to come by and get a picture because we come, we come a long way now. This is just not for black people to celebrate. This is for everybody to celebrate and commemorate. Everybody should recognize how important this day is, regardless of the culture, the race or whatever. In Indianapolis, Rich and I, 13 News.